Okay, so uh, while we wait for others to join, we'll just kind of get started. Um, let's see here. Uh, Miss Marion, if you're able to obey dots, I. Oh. <clears throat> story, I call spotted wings. Oh, they dark e. Ma, oh, they ain't to a ton. Go, make it go, ball, go. They go, pay dog. Ain't a key. Go, a son, dog. Go, a dog, ya, eight more, hey, ma. Go, go, a hoe on, ya, oi. I get so, but more, hey. They, they go. Dot hole day. Obey ya. Haya get dot all. Tongo. They go on a time a good time. Ya ain't on a eight hain they do. Ain't hold a key. So long. Hain they get eight more hain more. Go it, don't get they hunt the young high, you know. Boy, good, go up, they keep wrong. Dot hope, dot hide, oh. I'm bailed out, a goat on the top. No outside, bailed out. They hunt the get ag on the top. Don't call on her, dog e. Dog e, ah, oh, the young, oh. Oh, bow. Amen. Amen. Aho. Aho. Awesome. Oh, hey, there's Grandma Martha now. Hi. You're just in time. We're just getting started. <laughs> uh, let's see. Okay, so we have uh, four mentors. We have Grandma D. We have Grandma Martha now and Miss Marion. And then for learners, we have Kathy, myself, and um, Grandma D, is Aunt Carolyn with you? Not right now. Okay, okay. Oh. Um, okay, so let's see. I think we wanted to continue practicing grammar. Um, so we're going to check in our little study folder and see if there were any updates. I think we had some questions last week about uh, updated PowerPoints, and then we practiced uh, level two on study stacks last week. So we'll um, take another look at those resources. Um, but first off, um, does anyone have any questions? Do we need any translations or anything? Okay, don't hear any questions. Um, let's see, do I have any questions? Um, well, let's see. Um, I don't see Dane on. Uh, Grandma D or Grandma Martha Nell, did, did y'all have a uh, credentialing board meeting today? Not today. Oh, not today. Week. Yeah. Last week. Oh, okay. Okay. Do you know if uh, Dane is going to join today? I'm not sure. Um, he didn't say, but, um, you know, he's still in his classes through next week. Oh, summer that's school. right. Summer school. So he may not be on here. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. Okay. That's right. I forgot about that. Um, I'm sure he's, they're doing, uh, getting ready for their finals and stuff for summer. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
Okay. Um, well, let's see. Let me look at our, let me open the Google Drive and look at our credentialing study material folder. So let me share my screen. Now we're going to look and see um, what, uh, if there were any updates. Um, oops, shared with me. Um, let's see, credentialing study material. Um, okay, somewhere. Uh, oh, there it is. Okay, so the level two checklist is here, and so is the level one checklist. Um, grammar. Level one grammar. Okay, so I think the one that we were kind of waiting on or seeing if it would be uploaded here is a uh, grammar um, for level two PowerPoint. And actually, let me look here in this folder and see. No, those are level one. I was going to look and see if there's any. So there's this, these level twos, but those are, I think, outdated. Um, yeah, those are from like last year. What's this? Oh, okay. So Dane added this folder in here. Um, which is the recordings of all of the uh, level one uh, grammar. Those phrases that we studied uh, in study stacks. So in, under the recordings folder, he's got um, all of those recordings. So someone who's studying for level one can just kind of make a playlist and use that to practice. Let's see. That's cool. Um, and I bet you anything that um, after Dane finishes up with his classes for summer, then he'll be able to uh, upload that level two PowerPoint. I know he said he was going to work on updating it. Um, so let's see. Actually, um, let me look somewhere else because. I think he, uh, Dane had downloaded that PowerPoint in our Zoom room one week. And let me look and see if I can find it. Okay. So how do we want to use our time today? So Kathy, it looks like it's just you and I for learners. So how would you like to use this time? Well, last week when I talked to Dane, he, I told him that I was interested maybe in possibly this week um, doing the uh, kinship part of the level two. Oh, okay. So I don't know if he's going to be in or not. You know, I mean, he didn't say if he was, but he knew that I was going to try to do that. So, uh, yeah, that's what I've been trying to concentrate on so I can get him the, you know, the bite, the sound bite that he needs for that oh. part. Yeah. Um, do you want to uh, look at the uh, kinship terms? Do you want to do like study stacks and see how you're doing? Yeah, I mean. <laughs> You know, I've, I've been trying to do study stacks, but I, I think I'm getting them confused with the male terminology. Oh, okay. So I'm not really sure now. I'm like, I, I went confused. Okay. <laughs> well, we can uh, we can take a look at it and it'll be a good refresher, um, if anything. Okay, so let's go to um, study stacks. 
Okay. Can you see my screen? Oh. Okay. Uh, and you said uh, level, level level two, right? Okay. Level oh. two uh, kinship female version. Maybe okay. that's what I was doing. I couldn't see it on my phone. Okay. Oh, okay. All right. All right. So this one is my sister. You can use a proper term sister, but my sister. So let me see. Would this be well, I'll, I'll let you answer first, so, Kathy. No, E. No, E. That's what I would say, too. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Oh. So, okay. No, E. This, this other term, E. No, E. 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 Is that term referring to our great grandmother on either side for a female? I think so. Okay. But that's your great grandmother. That top one is just my sister, like your sister. That bottom one's always going to be for that great grandmother word. Uh. Well, how is uh, this uh, this proper term for great grandma? How is that different from op e? Like op e. Well, in this case, it there is somebody's talking about their own great grandmother, e day. Okay, e day ain't doll. You're telling someone that's your great grandmother, e day. So you're not uh, calling to. Uh -uh. Mm. Okay. Okay. All right. That helps. Mm -hmm. Does that make sense, Kathy? So, female's great grand. Oh no, that's granddaughter, grandmother. Ah, mm -hmm. So that's your great grandmother. Mm -hmm. Okay. You can tell so, someone that's your great grandmother. Okay, and, and then the top uh, one is just your my, sister, your regular sister. So my my great grandmother Ah So that's like sister yeah right? just, just, just your oh. regular you know sister in your family oh so it's like a novel. sibling like yeah, sibling, sibling. Oh, okay. <laughs> and the other one's reserved for grand describing your grandmother great grandmother oh. mm -hmm. so could we say not eat they you don't even have to say no. You just be saying e they ain't all. You're telling someone this is my great grandmother. E <clears throat> see, because if you add that sentence onto it, it makes a lot of sense. But if you just see the word, it comes through as well. Okay, I see. Um, okay, I want to make a note. Or you can even say ain't they, meaning this person right here ain't they e they ain't all. That means you're telling someone this person right here. It's my great grandmother. Oh. Okay. I want to make a note of that. I have to switch to my little keyboard thingy. Yeah. Let's see. If I can remember that. Okay. Yes, so when we're saying uh na e that sibling oops oh hey there's judy sister And then if we are telling someone, so you said we could say, e they ain't all. Mm -hmm. Telling someone that's your great grandmother, not your sister. I mean, like sibling, you know. Oh. Top one would be the way to say it. Eat they ain't all. Ain't they? Ain't they? Ain't they? Ain't they? Ain't it's all. that uh, T. T D um 
Ainda. 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 Is it nasalized or is it is it a nasalized? No, it's just an A da. A da. Is it A H A N H? Yeah, I think so. Is it e, is how it, would you spell e, it with uh, e, I think E N is the way to correct it. E oh, okay. E N. Uh-huh. E da. Okay. It's kind of a possessive in a way, talking about possessive. My my grandmother, great grand great grandmother. So you're like telling someone, you know, it's the Kiowa way of saying that's my sister. But at the same time, you have to kind of separate from saying my sibling sister. Uh, so really get, it mixed up. <laughs> get it mixed up there. Mm -hmm. Okay. So let's do my sister. Let's do my. Uh... Like, for okay. instance, hey, like for instance, I'm going to say. My real sister has a nickname, and we call her Bunny. And if I was trying to introduce you to her, I would say um, Bunny Nop E A D to let you know she's my sibling, and leave it at that. But then, if I went down and was talking about my great grandmother, then I have to change it a little bit. Okay. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. So, like for me, my sister's Angela Laura, so I could say Angela Laura Nop E. Ada. Yeah. So you're telling someone that's your sibling sister. As opposed to if yeah. I was talking about mm -hmm. my great grandma, then mm -hmm. I would say Ete Ada. Mm -hmm. And you're introducing her to somebody. Or oh, telling okay. her. Hi, Judy. Hi. <laughs> we're uh we're just uh looking at practicing level two kinship terms because uh kathy's been studying and she wanted to just make sure she's on the right track so that's what we were doing oh, oh okay and i'm one trying day. to type this out so i can put it in the chat for us go ahead one day so hyundai and Saida. uh so there is no female brother it's just opposite gender sibling right Are you talking about uh, now talking about a great grandfather? No, brother. Like there's no female brother, and on this list, on right. this grade, but it's got opposite gender sibling, not Don, not Don, uh, oh. uh, brother. So that's mm -hmm. for the that's for the woman. Yeah, she's gonna always call her brother Don. So why didn't they just say female brother? He does that. Female's brother. Where, where is it on this card, though? It's on, uh, you know, where it has uh, grandfather, grandmother. It's the black one. Uh, Melody, do you know which one I'm talking about? Uh, the the uh, Down here? The chart? No, not that one. On that? the one on, uh, doc, on the documents. Oh, oh. the uh, table? Yes. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, These yeah. are all the terms that this goes through. I'm looking for a brother. So there it has males. Here it has my brother, your brother, her brother. That's the one on the chart. Yeah, it's on the chart, but it's under opposite gender sibling. Oh. Right, okay. So all right. I think it's because you, uh, because Kiowa way we refer to our same gender siblings differently than how we refer to our opposite gender siblings because of the respect, I think, mm -hmm. is how Grandma Dorothy's explained it. Okay. So that, that's why. It's just kind of, I think uh, it's worded that way to make sure that we're paying attention to the cultural like nuances there so it's not just like so in english we call them siblings but mm -hmm. in kiowa we differentiate whether depending on their gender where are you at i guess i don't know 
I'm just going off of how I would interpret it. <laughs> well, I killed him. I don't know if that for, makes any sense. For a female, she's never going to say her brother is her Bobby. They're never going to hear that. Oh. Yeah, when she talks about her brother, it's always going to be her Aton. Aton. It's always going to be Aton. Aton. It's going to be like Bobby, like the guy said. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh. Mm -hmm. Oh. It's real complicated, I'm telling you. This, uh, I know. <laughs> I know. This, uh, when I it, you know? and, which is why I don't teach it in my classes because I don't have enough time to do it to really spend, <laughs> you know, uh, detailed time. And I, I might do it as a reference sometime and give them an information thing. But as far as putting it in the, the whole teaching thing, it would take a lot of time to go through all these and make sure that they're learning it. Yeah, it's just it's just complicated is what it is. But with the way we're structured, <laughs> male and female saying things. Yeah, and they'd have to practice it a lot too. I thought about yes. that too for the uh, my high school curriculum for uh -huh. the Kiowa language at Weatherford, and um, I yeah, I'm just gonna have kinship be like a reference. Yeah, but that's what I use it for. It'll have to be for like you know if maybe there's a third year of Kiowa or something. <laughs> yeah. Actually, the way I kind of bring it into my teaching is um, at the beginning of class, I'm talking to the students mainly about what their behavior should be. And that's when I point out the thing of how our kinship works. And there's a lot of cross references to us, you know, and the fact that uh, showing respect for your brothers and sisters, you always do that. And I kind of put that on them so I don't want nobody in there just breaking out with some kind of crazy terms and stuff like that. So we don't do that in Kiowa. There's too much respect for your, not just your brother and sister, but of course your in-laws and things like that. It just goes on and on. Well, that's a good, I like that context. So it's in the context of respect first. Yes, the whole thing is about that. Oh. And and what my um my um uh, for example might be is um if your brother and sister are in the same room and you got other people there that don't know any different, and then all of a sudden the conversation goes off color, I say that brother or sister is going to leave the room because of our respect for that other other sibling. Oh, so that, that's what I can't bring in with that. But otherwise, if you try to teach all of this like that it, that's all you would be doing is teaching this <laughs> it's, it's time consuming i know and it can get really um um confusing confusing for a student oh. who oh. barely is learning the language much less all these little terms yeah <laughs> now if somebody I, asks me something about it i will you know talk about it and let them know what i try to answer the question but yeah, this part is really, really uh, intricate. Oh. Okay. Hande, I'm side off before you move. Um, great grand, great grandmother, you know, Nopi, P Day. What other names for great grandmother? Well, if you're calling, I mean, you're talking to her, to your great grandmother, mm -hmm. you would, to get her attention, you would say Op E. Up here yeah. oh. to get her attention and then start talking to her. But this one is this one is when you're talking about her. About her, yeah. Someone else. <laughs> yeah. You're okay. maybe introducing her or something or letting them know who's who. Yeah. Okay. I almost feel like um, well, I I guess that table chart kind of does that a little bit, but Something that would help me is like uh, basically when to use each of these, like um, oh. like what you just said, uh, introducing someone versus getting their attention. Right. It's like another way to describe describe the um, how was it phrased? Uh, calling to versus right. Um, if you trying to get your yeah. great grandmother's attention, then you're gonna say op e and then say what you want to say to her to get it. 
See, I'm going to be using this term here. This term is just to tell you who she is to someone else. Oh. Mm -hmm. I think that's important to, to know the uh, context when we should use these. Mm -hmm. I think I'm going to, I'm going to add some notes to my little, uh, yeah. my little cheat sheets. <laughs> and so I guess what I'm saying is you have to kind of know what realm you're in, if you're um, talking about them or you're, um, you know, trying to describe who they are and, or if it's like that knob E, you're just already telling somebody, this is my sibling sister. And maybe say her name or something like that, but there's the two differences there between the generations, I guess. So it's like uh, talking to them versus talking about them. Mm -hmm. Well, also at the same time, that first one up there on that next other page that you had, where mm -hmm. it says not e, that's another way of introducing your sibling. Um. I don't think you'd just be saying it out to them, but <laughs> you'd probably be calling them by name if you wouldn't call them. When you say, you could say like uh, your sibling's name, not yeah, he, yeah, yeah. Ingo. Yeah. So you're introducing them. Okay. Yeah. Oh, this is helpful. Okay. We have 67 left. <laughs> 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 okay uh your sister who remembers this a p a p e e e e e e e a p e a p e yeah your sister uh, e. Your sister. Ah, oh, it's your and while ago we had no, which is my, my, my sister. Uh, mm -hmm. No, uh, and ah, uh, no and ah, two different uh, pronouns there, really. Now this could be um sibling is this just referring to sibling or could this be great grandmother also if you're talking to your grandmother you could probably i mean great grandmother you could probably <laughs> say this and call, and letting her know you want to talk to her you could say up e and then whatever you want to tell her oh mm -hmm. but at the same time here this subscription here is this your sister your okay sister. so it's more sibling then mm -hmm. yeah okay your sister. Uh, let's see. I think I saw. Hey, Nelson. Hande, own day, aim, boom. We're uh, practicing the level two female kinship terms. Uh, we have a couple that are get, getting ready to uh, get tested for the kinship. So we're just kind of reviewing these. But uh, let us know if you have any questions and we can look at the. Uh, I think you might have already done the level two male version. Is that right? I think Nelson? you did. Yeah. I think you already did it. Mm -hmm. I don't know if his audio is connected, but I think you did it already. Awesome. Okay. okay. So let's go. Okay. Her sister. Okay. Mm -hmm. Up e day. Up e day. Her sister. And so in that case, the sample might be like this. Um, uh, I'll just throw in a name. Jennifer, up e day, a da. That is her sister. Jennifer is her sister. A da. Mm -hmm. That is her. So you said the name first, uh -huh, and, and then, then up e they, 
I that's, her, that's her sister. This and I made up that name. Just say somebody's name. Mm -hmm. That's that's the way. I mean, that's maybe that would help to remember who it is you're talking about. That oh. is her sister. Oh, me too. I found yeah, it definitely helps to use them in a sentence. <laughs> right. Getting more words around here. Exactly. <laughs> like that. Let's see. I'm gonna um I'm making little notes. Happy day. Uh go. No. Uh oh. Looks like Nelson lost connection. Okay. Uh no. Is that uh up? Up tone, uh, da. Up down, up, uh, da. And that would be um, I'm trying to put these in the chat for our reference. Uh. Is her sister? She is okay. I don't know if this is a an accurate translation, but Grandma Martha, I'm gonna put this in the chat and then tell me if this is like correct or not. We'll go look at it. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then sister's name. So the Kai was on top and then the English is on yes. the bottom. Yes, that's kind of a good, a good, good description. Okay. Mm -hmm. Awesome. All right. Uh, okay, let's go to the next one. Okay, if you're just calling to your sister. Mm -hmm. My name. My name. Oh. Mm -hmm. Or like we said, if you're talking to your great grandma, you can yeah. say, oh. All right, my brother. No, 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 and then no, no, day, no, day. So this, the second one. What's a um, what instance would we use that second the bottom term in? Like when would we use it? Telling someone that's your brother. You're basically saying it. You might say a so and so no thaw ain't dog, but at the same time, you're going to go to the next one. It'd be um, to give his name again and say um, thaw they ain't dog. Again, oh, okay. it, it is. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. This is my brother. Okay. Yeah. And this is a uh, so sibling. And you said you could say no thaw or thaw they ain't dog. Right. Okay. You're telling Let's someone. Say they're two right? right. And it, it's just like, oh, it's almost like an immediate thing, right? That top one is so and so, no, no, I don't. Just saying he's right here and I'm introducing him. Or you could just go ahead and use the second one and just say the same thing, but you're just kind of telling them that that was your brother. But see, there it says occasionally use. They don't use that second one all the time. You might use that first one a lot to say, this is my brother. This is my brother. And again, it's the same thing. Ain't they? No, no, ain't no. This is my brother. Is what you're saying right there. Could we say like a, like we did with sister? Could we add their demon? Like say, yeah, right. you know, John, ain't mm -hmm. they? John, no, no, ain't no. Right. Ain't no. Yeah, that makes more sense because that's who you're talking about. Okay. I'm, I'm starting to see some structure of the sentences here. This is helpful. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, okay, and then you said for the example, uh, for the second term, let's see, could we say uh, John Don Don they ain't Don. Yeah, he's yeah, he's my brother. 
but it's occasionally used so that you don't hear it that often. It's almost kind of like an older term, I guess, or something. But uh, like, for instance, if I uh, taught my kids to address each other or to talk about each other, mm -hmm. it'd be okay to use both kind of interchangeably. Yeah, as long as they're <laughs> understanding it. That top one is kind of, to me, more used now in our modern day. The yeah. Other, like I said, it's kind of an older term. Well, it's also that na, na, thought is like it's more of like an English format like it's yes. like my yes. brother it's but projection. Kyle is kind of backwards like well not back English is backwards but yeah. we always talk about who we're talking about and then right and it's and really when you say no thought that's possessive because you're talking about my brother not somebody else's brother but just my brother hmm more than now, yes. Could you use uh, don't they if I want to talk talking to my little brother? Yeah, you could talk, say that to him. Yeah, because I've heard uh, I've heard my talking to him grandmother call my daughter he day. Right. Um, it's talking to that person. Yeah, to that brother. <laughs> so to that yeah. brother. Yeah. yeah, to make it a little easier. <clears throat> oh, that's helpful. Okay. Uh, let's see. Like, like, for instance, I'll give you a for instance on a second one. Um, don't they, um, uh, um, okay, yeah. Delta or something like that. So you're actually talking to him, like she and, said. And that would be for your great grandson no your brother oh you're, brother. you're si okay we're still in the brother we're still in okay. the brother. <laughs> <laughs> okay uh let's see don't don't they or no okay so that can be either talking Kinda saying like that talking. they're your brother or, yeah, like they're my brother them. or talking to them yeah, talking to them. Don't they? Uh, on them tight. You could use it like that. Say, brother, come here. I'm gonna ask you a question. Oh, okay. So, on the inside, thought, Grandma Martha. Um, if I'm labeling, like, let's say my phone contacts, and for for my brother and i'm changing his you know the phone on the on my little cell phone thing yeah the contact information could i say don't they and then sunny like is that appropriate or would it um, would it just well, be basically you're telling someone else that do you need to tell somebody else that? That's just for your information on your phone, right? Right. So, so, you could, so I could say not on. Not on who, you know, put the number there or whatever. If you okay. just had one brother, of course you have one number. If you have two brothers, <laughs> then you probably have to put a name in there. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> okay. Um, but uh, let's say my brother comes to visit, then I, I'm trying to get his attention or something. I could say don't they. Yeah, and then talk to him. Yeah. Talk to him. Oh, talk okay. to him. Yeah. Okay. That's that's helpful. Uh -huh. Okay. What about if you're dressing like happy birthday brother? Would you say like don't don't you know, I don't know what happy birthday is, but um, would you say, brother, happy birthday? Yeah, if you're talking to him. See, remember I said, if you're talking to yeah. him, you okay. don't say, you could say, um, don't they, they own them, Tonton. It's good that you were born and came here. So you're talking to him oh. with it, don't they? Melody, write that oh. down. Wait a minute, hey, don't they? Don't they. Can you uh, repeat the birth? How you said that again, Grandma Martha? 
Dante Dante and Todd son. It's kind of like a happy birthday. Mm -hmm. saying happy birthday. But it's good that you came here or you were born. Yeah, and you're and she's talking so, to him so she can use that don't they to get yeah. his attention and say what she wants to say. What you gotta go for the bird, bird Not really about him. Out. Oh not, yeah, I, I just have to put the diacritics on it. Yeah. And then I'll put it uh -huh. in the chat. Mm -hmm. Um so so you said that that's a like say you're putting it you're you're talking to them to him, to him. and she's saying happy him. birthday yeah like she's glad he was born and he came to their family okay so, so then he they... wasn't using nothing about not up there <laughs> you, <'cause> you're <laughs> talking to him now you're talking to him not about him right okay oh. so don't they don't they they don't they aim taunt son aim taunt son that you were born basically okay um uh, is that your sibling brother or your little brother your sibling it's still talking to your sibling i have to fix the diacritic marks on here but i will put it in the chat what i have so far mm -hmm. oh the nasal didn't the nasal eyes didn't copy over let me try it again and then I have to use the dang brackets because <laughs> it took away my strike throughs. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's good what you've got in there. Just pretend the ends are nasalized for da, de, on, de, and ta. Huh. The only one that's not nasal huh. is the uh, last one for son. Oh, son means to come here or be born. Ah. Oh. Sound that's okay. your birthday. <laughs> oh, oh. That's how you say happy birthday. So, <clears throat> for our sister, <laughs> would you say the um the AP day day on day? Yeah, you would be saying uh, AP e. day on day and talk. Huh? E. I know I got pop my peas. I'm sorry. <laughs> e. 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 Oh gosh, you have a lot of things here. <laughs> um, I'm trying to fix the diacritic marks. Yeah. Um, I think that's a ton, ton. This is really informative. Uh, Good question, Kathy. <laughs> oh, hey, there's Miss Belma. Let me let her in the room. Because I was leaving off the day, I, you know, I was saying da, da, day on day. You know, I was saying happy birthday. I wasn't saying don't, don't day. Probably other ways to say it, but to me, that's always the simple one. It's on time, day, I don't. Oh. Oh, day, I don't. It's a birthday day. Oh, yeah. And Carolyn, I put the uh, updated diacritic mark version in the chat. Oh, that's oh. Yeah. oh. Awesome. Okay, let's see. Okay, your brother. Your brother. Uh, uh Don. Uh, Don. Mm -hmm. Bill or they? Uh, Don. Oh. Her brother. Um, happy dog boy. Let's see. So this is the same pattern as the her sister. So I mm -hmm. thought mm -hmm. so they. The whole sentence. Is, oh, okay. I thought they. I don't. That is her brother. 
Oh, okay. Yeah, I like the sentences. Okay, so <laughs> <me>. <laughs> I'm going to add that in and I'll put uh, it in the chat. Uh, don't they, uh, don't. That means that's her brother. Uh, don't they, uh, don't. Mm -hmm. uh, is that uh, don't. up? Uh, yeah. Don't. Oh. Mm -hmm. That is her brother. Now I feel like we're doing those little see Sally run. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's how you learn. It's a little <laughs> I guess. <laughs> I saw her run. Hey, no. <laughs> Got to start somewhere. <laughs> see Jane run. Remember those little things? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Is that? Uh, oh man, I forgot the other. It didn't copy them. Okay, pretend there's a bracket after this or before the second D. Oh, Let me update it so it'll just in case someone's taking notes. Okay, there you go. Okay, let's see. Brother. We're just calling. Just their just name. Mm -hmm. Their name, yeah. My grandpa. Not Kong. Not Kong. Not Kong. Not Kong. Okay, so for this Kong Bay, is this the same concept as we, we were talking about? Right. With On the great grandmother thing? Yeah. So we could say, Kong Fei Aang Da. Okay. Telling someone who he is. And that is referring to your grandfather. And no Kong, he is just saying that's my grandfather. Again, it's possessive. Anytime you see no on it, it's going to be a possessive kind of a uh, pronoun. Okay. Male grandchild. What's male grandchild? Male grandchild. What was that? On here it says for male grandchild is not Kongi. Male male's grandchild. I thought we were in the female stuff. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, this is female. See, that's where I get that mixed up. Okay. <laughs> right. Oh, now, 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 don't confuse us. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Kong Fei Aim Dong. Great, or not great, grandfather. I'm trying to keep up with the chat, guys. Sorry. This will help for notes later. <laughs> you know, really in Kiowa. Then they're not gonna be saying no Kongi. They're just gonna be saying Kong. Kong. We're talking about your Kong. Kong. But that's a whole thing right there. I like the uh, library. Library. Kong Fei. Like I don't know. That oh. feels more Kiowa than saying no. I feel like the not like the possessive. I feel mm -hmm. like that's more English. Mm -hmm. Type of thinking. My grandfather and the other one is just oh, and his grandfather. Oh, hey! Okay. And again, he's talking grand. to him too, talking to him like you know, you could say uh, something okay. like "come, come with you know, what are we gonna say to him? Like the "come, come they." Uh, one day inside though. Mm -hmm. Anything like that, yeah. Okay. That was a uh, conky. This one, oh. Mm -hmm. Your oh, grandpa, ah, uh, oh, is your. Yeah. Oh, is mine. Her grandpa. Ah. Uh, mm -hmm. I mean, uh, her. Oh. Ah, uh, Kong Yoi. Kong Yoi. Ah, uh, Kong Yoi. Uh, 
Akongyoi. Akongyoi. That's where I get my joy. Yeah, because yeah. it changes from your <clears throat> to her. Okay, Akongyoi. Grandpa, isn't this just Kong? It's Kong. 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 Or I guess if you're trying to get their attention, you could say Kongte if you Kong are being really proper. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they're, not, they're not listening. Hey. <laughs> they, they can't really. They're hearing it at all. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. My grandma, my father's side. So this one is the Tal Yoi here. Is that the same concept? Yeah, as, as those other ones that you put notes on in your it's like the Conte type. Which, uh, again, that's like uh, Dolores said, he could be speaking to them. Okay. Yeah. Um, joy. So if I wanted to be really proper and talk to my grandma on my father's side, I could say, mm -hmm. Tal Yoy. Mm -hmm. Okay. No, totally. Does that make sense, everyone? Oh. So, could, so I could say, uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, and you're all you're telling someone is that your uh, paternal grandmother saying okay. it like that, paternal grandmother, not your maternal grandmother. Oh, okay, let me just type that. Um. Oh, joy. And my paternal grandmother. There you go. I can't type. Uh oh. Okay, check this. <laughs> so I'll try one here. So this would be. Top of my oh, no, no, no. Uh, Natali and uh, and uh, mm -hmm. long to you. Huh. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, it's kind of the I like using it in a sentence, it really helps to oh, like right. differentiate because. <laughs> These terms have been such a, such a jumble in my head for the longest time, and I think they're finally making sense. <laughs> I'm telling you, they could get very complicated. <laughs> oh. uh, I feel like it's, uh, I don't know if anyone's Harry Potter fans, you know, have the, the sorting hat, <laughs> and they're sorting them into, <laughs> that's how I feel. <laughs> okay. Your grandma, your paternal grandma. Mm -hmm. Um, uh, 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 Tali. Uh, Tali. Mm -hmm. uh, Tali. Okay, good. Or, uh, Tali. Uh, Her grandma. Uh, Tali. Oh, you did you added Ada at the end? See, yeah. this is her. It, it is her great grandma on her dad's side. See, yes. I like that. <laughs> it's her grandmother on her dad's side. <laughs> Um, let's see. Ata yoi ada. Ada. Okay. 
Okay, another clue. Um, no. I don't know if this is an accurate translation, but here I'll put it in the chat. That is her, that is her grandmother. Um, By name? Lee. No, it's Ta Lee. Oh. <laughs> oh. Ta Lee. Ta Lee. My grandma, okay, now we're talking maternal. Right. Oh, uh, let's see. So is this the same? So this could also be used if you're talking to get their attention. Yes, talking to that person. Okay. The other top one just identifies who she is to you. Oh. It's possessive. My grandmother. Awesome. Okay, your maternal grandma. Mm -hmm. um, let's see. Uh, uh, her maternal grandmother um uh, Grandma, maternal grandma. Mm -hmm. uh, Okay, my dad or any of his brothers. Um, let's see, my dad. No. 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 So let's see. Uh, if I'm putting this in a sentence. Uh, uh, da, this is my dad. Like, uh, so I could use my dad's name, Tim Redbird. Right. And that's your possessive right there. Oh. But again, if you're calling to him, I'm going to talk to him or something. No, no. To get his attention, then you can Don, use the toy. second one. Da, and then say a question or answer something. Oh. That's that same one that uh, Dolores said you could use it in talking to them. Oh. Oh. Okay, your dad or any of his brothers. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. So your so this is a talking about yeah about how they're related to you. Okay, so this is the one where if I am like 
talking your about dad. them, could I say? You're just going to say your dad. I thought I thought your dad. And it could be those brothers too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I thought I thought. Can you use this in a sentence? Um, let's see. Um, Okay, let's just make up a name. Um, Bill, I thought I thought. How do? How Asking a question. How do? Is he your dad? Is Bill? Your oh, how do? How do means is he that? Is Bill your father? Because you may not know. I mean, you might even know who those people are. So Bill, I right. uh, uh, and. Or you could just be talking about him like, you know, your father, and your dad, and you could say, um, oh, let's see, wait. Um, I thought, uh, get yeah, boom. I saw your dad. I saw your dad. I thought, uh, get yeah, boom. Oh. oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, so you're saying, saw your dad. yeah. Yeah, boom. Uh, boom. Yes, babies. Did you say Gabon? Yeah, Gabon. Yeah, I said, I saw your dad somewhere, is what you're saying. Yeah, Bon. Yeah, bon. You didn't say where, but you said you saw him. <laughs> somewhere. <laughs> somewhere along the way. <laughs> Point your lips over there. <laughs> <laughs> way over there. Uh, I saw the Gabon. Yeah, um so how did you say it's translated like i saw your dad mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> i saw your dad somewhere okay i'm just trying to keep up with our chat here oh okay her dad or any of his brothers um Okay, who knows this? A doddle day. A day. Or a doll day. Is a it doll. day or a day? All day. A doll day. A doll day. So it should be a strike through? So yeah, it should, should be a second strike through. Okay. A doll. A doll. Day. And this is her dad. So, like, uh, let's see. Yeah, can you put this one in a sentence too? <laughs> um, like if I was talking about you, uh, Melody, I'd uh -huh. say um, your your last name is Tim, right? Oh. Tim, Tim, I thought they da. That that's her dad. Oh, okay. So it's like uh in third person, I guess. Yeah, because you're telling someone who he is. Yeah. Okay. So if I that, that belongs to you, see, so that all is where all comes in is you. That's that belongs to you. That dad belongs to you. So let's see. So the sentence was you put uh Tim I thought I thought they hey, I don't I don't if I, I was don't. telling someone he's your dad, it's Melody's dad. I don't they I don't. Mm -hmm. Is the the da is the tone down? Yes. The, okay. E and an A down. Every time we have a dog, it's probably going to be a dam. Okay, check this sentence. I don't know if this is. Yes. Oh. That, that is her dad. Again, it, that dad belongs to her, just her. Oh. So, Kathy, the, uh, that second D here should be strike through. Okay, so I, I put the bracket in the chat so we could remember. 
Okay. Dad. Um, name. Da. 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 Mm -hmm. Da. Da. <laughs> <laughs> Real loud. You go, what? Okay, mom. My mom. No, so. So, no. so no. This, this always threw me off <laughs> because I guess like, I never realized there's a couple different ways to oh, say cool. mom. So, Let's see. So na sa na sa is possessive, and then go goi is uh, if get, we're get her attention and talk to her. Okay. Oh. So I could say na sa and da, and then go uh, goi. Hiya and Bun. <laughs> yeah. So you're talking to her. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Aim ah. So my kids, they call me Ga. Mm -hmm. Is that accurate? <laughs> yeah, that's good. I'll just call you call you that to get your attention. Ga. Yep, all the time. <laughs> More of us that are here, the better off we are. It's just cute. I don't hear the English word mom anymore. It was pretty cool. <laughs> okay. Your or any Anyone? Who's got this? At thought day. Okay. I would remember this because it has the ga for mother. Uh, her mom or any of her sisters. Mm. Is this a uh, so day or a uh, so day? It's all day. So this should be a strike through. Day. Yeah, it's got that day sound. Day. Okay. That's, uh, day. I'll put that in the uh, uh, dog. Mm -hmm. uh, so. so we're on it. There you are. Uh, day. Uh, dog. Okay. <laughs> What now could include your mother's cousins and yeah. your father's cousins? Yeah. And also your mother and your father. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's not your aunt. It's no. your mother's it's your mother. sister. It's your mother's sister. Cousins. They're mm -hmm. also your mothers. Mm -hmm. oh. And the same rule with your father's brothers are also your fathers. Right. Same same difference. Oh. Oh. Okay. Mom. Go. 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 
Uh, okay, uncle. So uncles are only on the mother's side. Um, oh gosh, I uh, never ton, use this term. Ton, ten, 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 ten. Say guy. Say Okay, same difference in here that not a, that means that's my uncle, not no. a, and you're talking about him, but if you can speak to him, then you would be uh, addressing him as say, yeah. Not a, a dog. No, it's a, 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 a pop tea, a, 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 not a. Oh, okay. No. And it was it and nasal. Not a. Not a dog. Hey, uh, um, I have to run into the kitchen really quick. Uh, Kathy or Judy, can one of you share your screen? We're on number forty. Uh, I stopped sure. sharing, but I don't do have any study stat. Judy, are you able to share your screen? Uh, I don't think I can get it on. I'm on a different computer. How about you, Kathy? I'm not sure. Uh, I need about five minutes. It's off. Hang on. What's world? I'm trying to see if I need to uh, I make you a co-host. I don't know if that works. Okay. And I put the link to the set that we were looking at in the chat. Oh. I don't know. I even forgot. I don't know. My my uh, internet's kind of link uh, weak. Uh, I can see your screen, I think. Oh. Yeah. We can see your screen. Uh, let me stop my okay. video. Yeah. yeah, it says you are sharing screen. So now I think you just have to go to uh, the little internet thing. Let's see what time it is. Oh, four more minutes, I think. Oh, well, we're almost done anyway. <laughs> Mine's blurred out. So. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm kind of lost here. I don't know where I'm at now. Oh, here we are. Oh, there you go. Hey, okay. found it. Okay, oh, hey, we have uh, four more minutes, so. We're, well, now I know how to do it, so. Yay, oh. you did it, okay. Um, we were on number, uh, if you go to number, I think 39, or we got through 28 of them. So if you just flip through, click on the green button down there. Right, let's see here. Yeah, Where's so we get to. Then I guess to, we All got right. through 28. <laughs> okay, I'll be right back. All right. Grandma. <laughs> Grandma. Grandma. Yeah, do mother. Okay, dad. There we go. Okay, so we were doing uncle. And we did that. Not. Yeah. Hey. 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 Look, your uncle. Ah. Ah. If one of the mentors want to say that, he, so that way we can make sure we're saying it right. Let's see. So that word is at a, at a, pop tea. Oh, oh Jesus. <laughs> I don't know where we're at now. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was that. It's her, his, her. 
Where were we? <laughs> uncle. I think somebody's uncle. Mm -hmm. uh, Oh my goodness, we're so lost here. Your aunt. We need no. I was trying to get to Uncle. Uncle. Oh well. Number 29 or something, whatever. How do you even get down? Get to restart, retry number 20. <sighs> Hey, here we go. <laughs> Sam, Start all over. <laughs> okay, Dad, Mom. Okay, here we go. Uncle. We did that one. Yeah, no, that's the one I think we were on. Your uncle. Do you have to pop the T or? Yes. And you can say, oh, say that. Okay. Should we go to the next one? Mm. See what's oh. next. Her uncle. Yeah. Is it day? Day. Okay. I don't think it's a day with the strike do on it. I think it is like this. At ain't the other. At day. I don't. Um, it'll be day instead of day. it's just day. Andy, Andy, I day, I don't. This is her uncle. Okay, next one. Mm. Go just by name, calling. Mm -hmm. Seiki, just Seiki. Yeah, Seiki. Oh, I know that one. My aunt, other side. No, no, a no. Not say. Not Oh, yoy. So when you're calling her, you call her Tsai Yoy. Mm -hmm. When you're talking to her, addressing her. Your aunt. That's, that's your is. Ah. Ah. Thing. Gi, gi, sai, sai, as, asai. Yeah, asai or yeah, asai. You know, depending on what you can say, I'm gonna use it. <laughs> okay, asai. Got that one, Judy. Oh, oh. Her aunt, other side of me. Uh, it's a day, uh, day. Oh, yep. Oh. I try it. I try it. day. I try it. 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 Okay. I try it. I try it. Her aunt. Her aunt. Okay. Auntie, uh, her name. Mm -hmm. Oh, dang it! <laughs> it was by name. <laughs> or do you say Sai? 
Sai. Sai. Sai yeah. when you just talk it. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's Sai on a chart. Mm -hmm. uh, my son. No, 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 Then we got your son. Your son. <clears throat> I -E. I -E. Okay. I -E. Her son include sister son. Mm -hmm. uh, I go gioi. No. Mm -hmm. uh, I day. I day. I day. I day. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. <laughs> Sunny includes son. What? By name. My daughter. Naughty. On the side of no, we that, that, oh, yeah. that, that's where we had that question I was talking about that word oh. um say Tom say Tom isn't that the one that they say those men call their daughter mm -hmm. calling the somebody man use it. yeah they're that's saying I, I understood oh. Hi guys. No, I talk. Okay. Let me uh let me share. Okay, stop. Okay, it's back to you, Melody. Uh ho. All right, I think. Let me go back to the screen. <clears throat> All right. Um, let's see where were we? Let me go through. We're on daughter. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, your daughter. Yep, that's where this we're one? at. Okay. Yeah. Oops, sorry, I wasn't supposed to. <laughs> <laughs> your daughter, Aita. 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 Your daughter. Um, or no, what was that one you were talking about, Judy? Was the father saying Tom. to the daughter? Say, say Tom. Say Tom. Say Tom. Say Tom. Say Tom. Males. But that's only men only use that, right? Yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh. Okay, her daughter. I eat. I eat. Hey. Yeah. Uh, e. Uh, e. Oh, there's no. Uh, e. Oh, that's. Oh. Is this? That's what's on the chart. Is I T I E. Yeah, isn't this? Uh, this would be your son, right? Or her son? His or oh. her? Uh, e. That it is. Yeah. Uh, so you said on the chart it's uh, E. Huh, they. Uh, e T T A. So that's wrong. Yeah. yeah, this has to be corrected. Yeah. Dane, if you're watching this. 
<laughs> okay. So follow the chart on this one. Uh, okay, daughter. Name. Name. Line. My nephew, my brother's son. Hey, Doc. Hey, Doc. Hey, Doc. Hyundai, Hyundai inside out, real quick. Back to Sun, back to sun. Um, on one of the charts I saw, one of the ways to address them was both. Both. For what? Both. For addressing a son. A bowl day. Yeah, bowl, bowl day. Bowl, bowl. Okay, B O L. Oh, I was trying to figure out what you were bowl. pronouncing when, when you're talking about your son. When you're calling your son. You're addressing your son. Oh, you say boy. A no boy. <laughs> bowl day. Bowl. Okay. Oh, I think there's more. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. What did, say, what did, what did it say? Word? What did you say? Bold there it day? is. Passed it Bold up. Day. There it is. Right there. Right there. Right there. Yeah. That's male kinship. Mm -hmm. but that's a oh, male. Yeah, okay. we're talking about female on this side. Okay. 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 So on the chart that, uh, you know, that's on the document that I'm going by, it says mail calling, or uh, son, no e, I e, uh, and then over there, it says calling. Oh, yeah, right here. Yeah. Son. But... Yeah, that so bow is for men. And bow. Bow day. Bow day. Is that bow day? Proper. Bow day. Bow day. Let me look down here. I'll call you in a minute. I'll call you in a minute. Does this one not differentiate between male and? It does. Because you got the male. That's why I was asking oh. about the opposite gender sibling. Should have been female's brother. Oh, I see what he's saying. Thanks, Cece. Okay. Um, so this one is the one that we're looking at. Right. Yes. Mm -hmm. Hmm. That's interesting. <laughs> so both of both day is that so, for men? So what would we say as women? Wait. No, we already passed it. <laughs> For our son, oh, as women. Yeah. Well, it says we would just call them by name, huh? Right. Okay. Or like, could I say not E? Mm -hmm. my son. For my son, not E. Mm -hmm. Oh. Okay. Um. Okay, let's see. Your nephew. Oh, wait, do we? I don't think we did the last one. <laughs> okay, whoops. I, I'm guessing that would be no something. I forget. Who knows it? Who knows my. Yeah. <laughs> you well, this is your so yeah uh, um but the one my nephew i think you are right right is yeah. not um, no um no um for nephew and then, uh, -um. uh um but your uh, -um. uh her nephew uh, not, um day uh um day uh um day. Uh -um. Turn. Um, nephew. Uh, their name. name. Yeah. <laughs> oh. 
Okay. Uh, Naamta. Naam. Yep. Ta -ha. Na so, I want to Yay, I see a pattern. Uh huh. <laughs> Her niece, uh, 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 day. 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 Is this a a ta a um ta day or a um ta day? And day. Day. Which one? A um ta day. Day. Okay. So this should be straight through. A um ta day aim da. Aim da. Aim da. Right. If we're talking about them. Or saying her, this is her. Her niece. Her niece. Uh -huh. uh, um, ta, they, and da. da. Okay, niece. Name. 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 My grandson. Na. 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 Your Her grandson. Is this Amaki? Oh, oh, nope. <laughs> <laughs> Dang it. Ah, <laughs> my so joy. <laughs> so it's either going to be a day or a joy, and I don't know when it's going to be a joy. So that's, I'm just trying to figure that out still. Cause Does it have something to do with like whether you're talking about like her, like whether it's your, I don't know. I feel like there's a pattern there somewhere, but I feel like I have to see all of them at the same time. So. Right, at the gyoi. Yeah. So it's something to do with the male. Oh. Something. Yeah. I, let's see. If we go down to that list, we might be able to see it. So here's the my grandpa, her grandpa, her grandma. And then her grandpa, gyoi. Yeah, there's that joy. And then if we go, let's see. Her grandson, Ama Joy. So it goes with grandson, her grandson, and then her but, grandma on the mother's side. Right. And her grandma so on the bad. father's side. And her grandpa. Female's grandson, male's grandchild. Okay. Her grandson. Um, okay. Her name? Mm -hmm. My granddaughter. I know you have granddaughters. No, <laughs> no, Tita. No, no, Tita. No, no, Tita. Your granddaughter. Ah, monkey. So we have to pay attention to the uh, tones here. So we emphasize it until the last syllable. Her granddaughter. It does have something to do with the gender, whether you're talking oh. about a boy or girl. <laughs> but I don't know which one because it doesn't really do. 
with uncle or anything like that you know it doesn't do it anything but you know it doesn't do all the males right right it's uh it's like like it's like the grandparents and the grandchildren type seems like father yeah it is you're right yep i'm looking at it now their name grandson and grands so it's the grands okay Oh, my great grandson. Okay, we talked about this a little bit. Um, uh, oh, no, don't song. Don't song. No, don't song. No, don't song. No, don't say it. Oh, no. Hey, no. Possessive. No. So you use the ain da with the, the no. Oh, son, hey, no. It's my. Hey, okay. My little brother. Your great grandson. Mm -hmm. Ah, uh, 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 ah, 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 <laughs> Did we just do this? No. Her. Don't I don't there be a they at the end? Not the sun. It's on here on the chart, it's got day, not the sun. So it's I don't day. I don't day. That one needs to be corrected. Great. <laughs> Uh, name? No. <laughs> da san. Da san. Da san. Oh, brother. Okay, my great granddaughter. No. 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 No, that was Melody. Monday. Um, on that opposite. Um, so for the great grandchild son, it was Adasa. It was, because I was looking at it, it says great grandparent on the chart for. So look at the. You see what I'm saying? Let's see. Uh. Rocky, you choose the side, man. Where is it? There. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. For her, for your great grandson and her great grandson. Oh, it's the same. Yeah, that's right. Okay. And that's what it is on the chart. They have okay. a great grandparent on here great grandparent so we don't have it on there oh what's that what's that word uh great grandparent is not don don day mm -hmm. i don't i don't day i don't day i don't day um okay let me go back up sorry uh, uh see not son. I think we have problems with this too. Uh Pisa. That's for female's great granddaughter. Oh. Okay. And no. then your great granddaughter. Um E.
her great granddaughter. Uh, the same Api son. Api day. Api day. On the chart, it's wrong here. Well, is this accurate? Is it is this correct right here? Api day. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, so the chart's wrong. If you look at the chart uh -huh. for the great granddaughter, yeah, it's it's wrong. Right here. Uh so that should be IP for your. Oh yeah. And okay. then for his or her should be IP day. Okay. IP. Yeah. I think uh, Dane said he was gonna fix it because it was something about when he copied and pasted it. Mm -hmm. He had to fix it. Okay, last one. Little sister. Pizza. 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 Okay, let me stop sharing. Well, we got through it. That's good. Um, oh. So that was the female level two kinship. <laughs> so, okay. Um, well, I guess we better log off since it's like 825. <laughs> um, let's see. Um, Grandma D, would you be able to if you're able to play dots i oh come on uh they're on the title i'm going to get a more my dog get tom not like it and get high little they only so the girl can chain the dog get more hand my dog I hold it but her. I'm going to talk about Tom, though. You know, get high, it. Get it, uh, get it on. They only and hide it on. They get Sunday, they come they, I mean, daughter. They, you know, the third of the day. The, the own time, be I eat coffee, the, they do I hope. I hope. I hope. Hey, uh, next week uh, for the Indian Fair, if you guys uh -huh. are there, come by and see me, I'm going to be a vendor. Ooh, that's exciting. I know. <laughs> I wonder if, uh, I think uh, it's uh, the dances start Wednesday night for the kids. Um, Second, oh, third, we should fourth, have a session. You think everyone will be down there? Should we? Uh, uh, I don't know if we'll have it have a session next week because people might be busy with that. I don't know. Maybe I'll send an email out and ask. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll be down there and uh, like I say, come by and see me. It's the second, third, fourth, and fifth. Mm -hmm. Awesome. I'll be in the uh, Trader Building there. Okay, well, I'll come by and say hi. Yay! <laughs> okay. Awesome. Get, All right. Well, some of this forty cool. times. <laughs> <laughs> yep, right. stay cool. Oh. Hey, God, but oi, don't ta. Hey, God, I'm oi, bonta. Oh.